Today, we're going to be discussing everything we know about the Pokemon Black and White remakes. Over the years, Game Freak has steadily produced remakes of Pokemon games since the release of Pokemon Fire Red and Leaf Green. Since then, every generation except for Generation 5 has featured a remake of a previous Pokemon title. So that means if Game Freak doesn't change its tradition, Generation 5 and Pokemon Black and White are next in line for remakes. However, there are also rumours we might actually get a set of new Let's Go games with the Let's Go Johto series. This will obviously push back the remakes for Generation 5, meaning we could potentially see the remakes of Pokemon Black and White in 2027. It is also entirely possible that we might not even get another set of remakes. With Pokemon Legends Arceus, it seems like Game Freak is trying something new, and they're trying new ways to change their games, and maybe even potentially going away from remakes themselves. Legends Arceus was a huge success, and it's no surprise that Pokemon fans are wanting more like it. However, this doesn't entirely mean that we won't see black and white remakes if Pokemon continues to go down this route. A lot of Pokemon fans are actually suggesting that we get remakes from now one that are inspired like a Legends Arceus game. This would mean we would see a Pokemon Black and White remake in a Legends Arceus style game with the storyline focusing on the main one dragon. But the main question remains, do we even need Pokemon Black and White remakes? While there were a lot of Pokemon fans that were upset about the previous remakes we just got with Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, specifically with the art style and how the game looked. Personally, Pokemon Black and White 2 are Pokemon games I consider to be almost perfect, and I do feel like a remake is actually going to ruin them more than it's going to benefit them. Don't get me wrong, there are some pros for a Generation 5 remake. For example, not all the Pokemon from Generation 5 are currently available through the games that we've already received on the Switch. So, a remake of Generation 5 would give us access to all those missing Pokemon and be able to use them on the Switch. Another benefit is we could actually see the storyline of Pokemon Black and White and Pokemon Black and White 2 actually combined into one remake and potentially have a perfect story. However, if we don't get remakes for Generation 5, I think it's safe to say that we're not actually going to see any more remakes. Don't get me wrong, I am all down for Generation 5 remakes, but I really doubt that Pokemon is actually going to be able to pull it off properly. This leaves us with one last question. Can Pokemon actually pull off a black and white remake? Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl kept the same art style as seen in Diamond and Pearl, and Pokemon fans didn't like this at all. Pokemon fans didn't love the new chibi art style on the Nintendo Switch as much as they loved it on the DS or 3DS. Another problem is that Diamond and Pearl were very simple games. While they weren't on the Game Boy Advance like the other successful remakes, they were just freshly after it, so they still had similar characteristics. For example, camera angles were fixed, there wasn't places you could change the camera angle, it would pan out to view the region or buildings like we see in Pokemon Black and White and Black and White 2. Now obviously the Nintendo Switch can handle camera angles, it can handle color, but it's the ability for Pokemon to be able to recreate this in a way that still looks good. The biggest issue with Pokemon games is the notorious graphics as we see on the trees, the background and everything to do with it, but this wasn't a problem back in the day with Pokemon Black and White. The chibi art style and the pixelated graphics worked perfectly in a way that allowed you to still immerse yourself in the game and you didn't have to complain about the graphics being bad because that was part of the design. Now with the Nintendo Switch and remakes, Pokemon fans expect the games to look immaculate and keeping the chibi art style with the graphics still looking very poor is just not going to work. Not to mention Black and White not having fixed camera angles means we're going to see those pans of the cities and who wants to look at a city that still looks like mush and play-doh i do believe that if pokemon is going to make a generation 5 remake that legends arceus is the only way to go i do however also believe that potentially making a pokemon black and white 3 and not going towards a remake side and more towards a new game side is also another perfect option but let me know in the comments down below would you like to see pokemon continue making remakes and continue on generation 5 or would you like to see them completely stop and continue making games like pokemon legends arceus Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a like. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in my next one.